Hey everybody, it's your buddy Eric, and this is Honest Fire for March 2nd, 2020. I am back, baby. I haven't been making the videos for a while because I was, I'm not sure, um, I almost wanted to say I was scared to, but I just pulled the cable out, um, because I was scared to, which seems weird, that's not really true, but it was just like, it was difficult to do anything, really, it was like, it felt difficult to, um, you know, it felt difficult, so, um, you know, but, um, it was hard to do anything other than just start, right, so, um, yeah, I think that's basically what it was, um, Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. So I just, maybe I just have to start doing things again. Um, if you've listened to news about Japan, um, school has been canceled for the next um month or so. Um, that's worrisome. Just in the fact that like you know, things changing. Um, you know, people be like, oh, you have uh, the month off. Well, kind of. I mean, like I don't have classes and like a lot of things to do. And I just had an interview today for the. Uh, the job itself because of the way those things are changing um you know they have to make the job open to the public and um every three years um you know i can re i can renew up to three years if i get the job again but um you know basically it's just like um worrisome if like you know someone comes in who's cheaper for them to pay because you know they hire someone new they don't have to pay them their my current pay rate and if they want to cut people you know whatever the interview was done by um, my current boss, um, who I don't know too well because I've only worked with her for a year because um, my boss does change frequently. Um, the head of, not the head of the VOE, but like the, uh, like the guy below him, I think, who does more work. It's kind of funny, but like, you know, I mean, well, not really funny. I think it's pretty common, but like, you know, like the head tends to like have have done they did their time so to speak right but then they're just like like um they do stuff and they sign off on stuff but then there's always the person below them who does a little bit more work it feels like or at least i see them more often i mean i'm sure they do the person i'm talking about head, head does work but like they don't like inter i don't interact with them other than like ceremonies and stuff um so i don't see what they do but i see this guy all the time right he's always at meetings and stuff and all that kind of stuff so i don't know it's biased but anyway um he was, um, like, the main guy at the interview. And then another woman who I don't really know. Uh, I've spoken to. She works at the VOE. Um, but I don't really know. But anyway, I knew two or three of them very fairly well. And the other one, you know, I've spoken to before. So, um, it was kind of weird. Because it's just like, you know, like, they're asking me questions. Like, you know, they're trying to keep it like the interview. But it's just like, we all know that I've done this job for years. And um, I know this job. I know this town in and out. You know, I've worked in this town longer than... than that some people, you know, at the BOE, you know, just I've, I've taught some, I've taught some of the future's teachers, you know, it's like, you know, I've, I have experience, so it's just like, eh, 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 eh. um, so we'll see, I mean, I'm not really, I'm not really scared of not getting my job, but, um, I'm half and half on it. On one half, I feel like if I didn't get my job, right, um, it would really be a kick in the ass to do something else. Um, but on the other hand, I just want to have the stability, but, um, you know, with this, um, like, no, no, like, like, I went to school today, no, it was the last day of the kids, and it's just, like, no classes, right, because, like, the teacher was like, sorry, like, we know you have to schedule classes, but things are kind of crazy, because we have to stop having classes as of today, so, you know, we have to get everything organized, and all that kind of stuff, I'm like, yeah, I understand, I understand, so I coded a bit um, for my site, and I wrote up an article about a second place stuff I got on a Legacy Tournament on Saturday. I was pretty happy with that result. And, um, you know, um, it felt good. So um, I'm just going to try to, I'm going to try to get myself on a schedule of, um, let's say I was a, uh, you know, uh, if I was, you know, up translator slash programmer you know freelance entirely i don't have much translation work at the moment but you know if i was making software writing code and stuff like that i'm just gonna try to write more code every day um for this next month i'm going to try to make some more videos of magic um kind of try to grind arena um grind legacy um stuff on magic online and 
just try to make content this month. That's my goal for this month, is make content. So I'll start with this again. 